Oh, but come on, friends, how often are we anxious? How often does anxiety win the day in the hearts of God's people? Now, if you're somebody like me who struggles with anxiety from time to time, that this isn't a message of condemnation. It is a message of hope. Our God is our peace. Our God is our strength. Let us find our hope together in him. Maybe just one more note on this whole idea of being reasonable or gentle or mild. Gentleness is not equivalent here with weakness or being unwilling to stand your ground. Well, the Bible calls us to be gentle, so we're just going to let everybody run right over us and have their way. And then, and then we'll, we'll just do the Christian thing where we, I'm being super spiritual, so I'm going to let you run over me, but I'm going to gossip and tear you apart as soon as you're out of the room, right? Because I'm more spiritual. Aren't you glad that never happens in our community? The death of every martyr argues the opposite. That Christians with wills of steel said, we will not bow, we will not move, we will not compromise on the gospel of Jesus Christ. In fact, we are willing to stand and live and die for what is right and true. No, Christians stand up for what is true. And yet we do it in a way that is covered in the grace of God. That isn't shaken by every moment where we feel like we either need to lash out or run away. But here's the call. Here's the second thing. Stop being anxious and start praying.